Okay, so we are at the sushi place in Yakuza 0 in Osaka. Now, this one is cheaper than this one, and I could have told you that, right? The more red it is, the less fat there is, which means it's less soft. And that doesn't mean the flavor is bad, it's just different, right? But generally, the fattier ones are softer, they're higher quality, it's more rare within the tuna. There's a little more nuance to it, and so that's why they're more expensive. So 500 yen for one piece, it could be two pieces. I don't think that's outrageous. Usually when you go out to a place that serves sushi like omakase, that's the term used for you just leave it up to the chef about what you get. You're not ordering individual pieces, you just order a set and they decide what's in the set. And usually what they'll do is they'll have like the regular and then the fancy and then like the cheap. So if you want the cheap eight pieces, you'll probably get in things like egg, maybe a salmon, like a basic salmon, a cooked shrimp. If you get the basic one, you're probably getting, you know, like maguro, the tuna, maybe some yellowtail, maybe some of the fish eggs, the ikura or the roe. And if you're getting the expensive one, then you're getting the fatty tuna, the more niche things like the uni, the sea urchin, and a lot more of the other fish. So it's not quantity you're paying for, you don't get like six, eight, or 10 pieces, you get six cheap pieces, six medium pieces, or six expensive pieces. So choice sushi set, you know, 10 more dollars, but for a step up in quality of the fish, might be worth it depending on who you are, might not be. But arigatou gozaimashita, she thanks us for coming. And that was our sushi stop in Osaka. So we've got-